All right, so. All right, let me just finish. This is a shame. My device keep cutting off. What's the scoop with the paper cups and the helmet? Yeah, seeing through the fog, your vision is getting clearer. Somebody, um, the authorities might successfully wrap up a legal case. I see that too. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody could have been posing as an undercover or, <laughs> um, <laughs> Somebody, uh, it's going to be like a big prostitution bus or a prostitution sting or something. Or something. Or like something to do with child trafficking, that page of cups. Yeah. So something like that going on, on too. So Earth Angels, what I, what I see in the cards too, it's been authorities 3D or 5D that have been investigating this is about prostitution, child trafficking. Um, what else did I say? Um, in that page of cups. Um, something. But this been going on since Christmas. So somebody been being watched, or a group of people been being watched since Christmas, and they might move in um, this week. So, Earth Angels, if you know you've been going to pick up prostitutes in a specific area since Christmas um, or for, for years or somebody need to stay away from somewhere. If y'all don't want to go to jail or something like that, I see that too. Because that page of cups could be an undercover. And they're posing as a lover, a child, or like a prostitute. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or something. So Earth Angels, y'all could um y'all was involved in this in some type of way. Or spirit could be telling me to tell you don't go to a particular area. Um it's like Earth Angels, say like you live in a neighborhood and um it was prostitutes, but it wasn't that bad. Over time, Earth Angels is like something getting bad. It's just ridiculous. It's like Earth Angels, um, this week, um, Spirit is telling me to tell you just don't be in the area. Or the universe might do something. You're not going to be able to travel. Um, so Earth Angels said like you was getting ready to go to the store. And the store where you go to is uh, nothing but prostitutes. Just something going on at the store. It's like Earth Angels is like... You could have been having a hard time finding your keys or or something like that. And it's because spirit don't want you to be somewhere or that's the wrong way or you shouldn't be doing that or earth angels you know better. So this is like prostitution or child trafficking. Somebody know better. It's the earth angel out here that could have been picking up prostitutes or they was uh, considering or dibbling a little bit into child trafficking or something or something. Somebody might also get their kids back, too, from, um, I heard a recovering addict, uh, in, um, some type of child trafficking. So, it could be a child could have got kidnapped or something, went missing. They're going to find the child this week. Um, it could have been a Libra, don't have to be, could have been a Virgo, a word of sign, don't have to be. So, it's going to also be some children return to their parents. Um, people gonna end up in jail, then it's gonna lead to them being sober because they're in jail. So some prostitutes that was like sprung out on drugs might get thrown in jail or whatever. So it's like collective, you're gonna get your loved ones back. Um, their lives is being preserved or something like that. Even if they end up in jail, their lives are being preserved. Yeah. So I see stuff like that going on too. Yeah, something has come to a complete end. And this could be like a legal case being wrapped up. Because somebody being watched. <clears throat> Earth, um, Earth Angels, for some of y'all, you used to go to a place with a lover. And Spirit telling you to hold back. Because something or someone is under investigation. 
Yeah, hold back from a place or something. Maybe hold back from going to a lover's house. Somebody that was telling y'all something was magical was meant to be. Or some of, this is somebody saying, come on, Earth Angels, do it with me. We're not going to get caught. We're not going to get caught. And this could be a work, love, and life. Earth Angels, somebody was telling y'all y'all wasn't going to get caught. Or Earth Angels, you dealing with this person and they married. And they wanted to mess around with you. And this person was telling you, oh, we're not going to get caught. My spouse not going to find out. Or something. It's like Earth Angels, if you're dealing with a married lover, Earth Angels, go be with your friends and family and leave this lover alone or something like that. At least for this week. Because this lover lying about something. Or something. Or somebody's saying they're single and they, they are, they're lying. They're really married or something. What's the spill with wrong way? The world in eight months. Toxic ways. Yep. So, Earth Angels, you got toxic ways. Spirit wants you to shy away from. You be visiting a toxic place, a location. Spirit wants you to shy away from. Or stay away from somebody with these toxic ways. Yeah. Bad habits, addictions, can't stay away from harmful, substance, harmful substances. Yeah. Somebody could also be allergic to seafood, like fish. Somebody could be allergic to fish. Um, Earth Angels, if y'all have an allergy to fish or, fish or something, Earth Angels, for some of y'all, y'all could be pregnant. And you know you're allergic to something, but you want to eat it. Spirit was telling you, uh-uh. So, Earth Angels, something might happen to y'all car or something. It's like your pregnancy cravings is, like, tempting you to do something crazy. So, Earth Angels, y'all could be allergic to, like, uh, seafood. And then it's like you pregnant and... You craving fish or something. And something might happen to y'all. It's like you're not going to make it there or something. Or something. Somebody could be allergic to fish too. I picked that up too. Or something going on with an antibiotic or something. Is somebody allergic to an antibiotic or something? Some type of substance or something. I don't know if this is fish oil you or something. Um, somebody could also be. I just saw it. Um, you know them little um, them little uh, infusion things, and it, it 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 go up in smoke, and you put it. I can't. I don't know what you call them. Um, somebody could be burning one of those. It's for incense. It's 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 for um. It, it's the way the smoke swirls. I forgot what you call it. It's like a oil lamp or something. And you drop the piece in there and it give off the smell. That's what I just saw. So for somebody, somebody need to know. It could be like a air freshener or something that somebody have an allergic reaction to something. It could be like a product. Somebody could be allergic to fish. And in this air freshener or this candle, it could have like a fish substance in it. And somebody don't realize like that's why or something like that. Something is almost undetectable. But it's like a substance or something. Or somebody allergic to fish oil or something and... Something. It's a substance or something. What's the spill with the four pentacles, uh, the ace of swords, and leaving it behind? Because it's like somebody not feeling good. 
And it's like somebody is asking somebody, what's wrong with you? And this person, like, I don't know. Somebody could be having an allergic reaction to something. Or somebody lied about something and it's catching up to them. This is like somebody saying, hi, my name is Ben and I'm a Virgo. And these people like, oh, Ben, we know you, Ben. Ben love fish. Like, we're going to order Ben some fish. <laughs> And it's like this person sitting here and they got to eat the fish because they lying. And then it's like this person allergic to fish or something. Or it's like this person don't know they're allergic to fish, but they're lying about. It's like this person saying, my name is Ben and I'm a Virgo. But really this name is Dan and they're a Libra. But it's like because this person was lying... Something, something like that. So this could be a con. Somebody could be a con. This person a Libra, <laughs> and they be conning people. But something, but somebody might have an allergic reaction or something. <laughs> so oh, I'm also picking up. It's a, it's a criminal out here that might get exposed because they gotta go to the doctor because they're gonna have allergic reaction to something, <laughs> and this person don't want to go to the doctor. Because they like a fugitive or something. And what it's like, whatever this is that's going on with this person, it could be karma. It's a married person. I also see it's a married person out here that's at home that's stressed out. Because they want to be with their third party. Now, Earth Angels, you could be this married person's third party. This person could be a Libra, a Virgo, or a water sign. And you're the third party. And it's like you're like with your friends and family. And this married person at home. <laughs> and Earth Angel, that was meant to be. Yeah. So your lover put you in a third party situation. And they unhappily married. They miserable. Earth Angel, that was meant to be. <coughs> mm -hmm. Yep. What's the spell? Yeah, a betrayal. Stabbing, backstabbing, disloyalty, doing you wrong, betraying your trust. Yeah. So, Earth, Earth, Earth signs. Earth angels. It could have been an Earth sign that betrayed you. A Capricorn, Taurus, a Virgo. This person could have Libra placements, or this person was a Libra sun sign with Earth sign placement. Possibly Virgo. Um. Earth signs, I mean, earth, earth angels, I see you might be leaving it behind or this person going to leave something behind. Maybe this person could have betrayed you in the past and they trying to do it again this week. Or if they're trying to betray you this week, it's like you going to leave before this person get to you. Or it's like this person might decide not to betray you or something or something. Yeah. There's some type of betrayal going on. Or maybe two people were supposed to go on a trip. But it was a betrayal. And one person might pull back. And it's like this person going to end up going on this trip alone or something like that. Somebody is dealing with a spouse. Somebody married. Or they got legalities. Or somebody a fugitive or something. So it's like somebody is like restricted on what they can and can't do. Because they're married or they're a fugitive or something. Or something. What's this film meant to be with justice and nine swords? What's this film meant to be? Yeah, sharp tongue. Yeah. So somebody got to eat their words. Somebody got, somebody regret something that they said. Yeah. Yep. This person has no filter saying nasty stuff. Has a tendency to say very critical things about people. Yeah. 
Yeah. So somebody could be getting karma. Or things you could be um I heard illegally but involuntarily being separated from like this person with a sharp tongue. Earth Angels, for some of y'all, I see in the cards, there's a legal case going on, and somebody put your name in it. And this person getting karma. Because they got a sharp tongue. Yeah. So, Earth Angels, it's like somebody was saying something behind your back, probably to the authorities or whoever. And it's like this person want to go on a trip with you, knowing that at, and you could be getting, you could go to jail or the cops after you to question you. And this person stopped there and said something. It's like, I think you, spirit might fix the situation to where you don't go on this trip with this person. This person might have to leave without going with you because it's like your car or something can't start, start or you can't find your keys or something. This person was doing something or saying something about you that you didn't know or something. Or oh, it's like, I see in the cards, it's like, Earth Angels, this person betrayed you. Don't go nowhere with this person. So, Earth Angels, for some of you guys, somebody's holding back from you because they know the truth. This person know that they're married. This person know that a child is theirs. Or somebody a snitch or something. So, Earth Angels, if you doing something with somebody... So, Earth Angel, say like you and your, this four of pentacles, y'all go buy drugs from the same spot every day. And all of a sudden, this week, this person be like, nah, I'm not going. You know, I'm straight. This person could be a snitch or something. It's like this person know that something about to go down or something like that. Because they got a sharp tongue. They be telling or something. Or something. That's another scenario, too. Yeah. What's the spill with seeing through the fog? Earth angels, y'all could be Virgos or water signs. Yeah, fake friends, yeah. Yep. Or earth angels, it was a water sign or a Virgo that was your fake friends. And these could be undercover. Somebody could be an undercover or something. So earth angels, y'all be careful. Look, the range. We're strange to twist the individual, yeah. A bystander, yeah. So some of y'all be careful because your friend or something could be a snitch or something. If y'all doing something y'all got no business doing, somebody around y'all be snitching. Sitting back and watching it all happen, not standing up for someone being hurt or abused. Yeah. And it could be because they're undercover or something. <laughs> somebody are undercover or something. Or somebody um be sex trafficking, uh, kids trafficking or prostitution or something. Or something like that. So, um, Earth Angels, your vision is getting clearer about some fake friends. Or this water energy and this Virgo energy is your fake friend. So somebody got a guilty conscience or somebody stressed out about their fourth house. So Earth Angels, for some of y'all, this Libra energy, this air energy, this nine of swords person. You don't trust this person. You don't view this person as your sense of security. This person is probably not your family. This person is probably not the same race or nationality as you. Somebody fourth house in reverse or something like that. Or something going on with somebody's car. Earth angels, for some of y'all, somebody is waiting for you to come visit them and you're not going to make it there or something like that. Yeah. 
We got something. So the fourth house is Cancer. Cancer is the chariot. So sometimes to me, the when the fourth house, the chariot going reverse, that could be like a um like failure or like a car accident or something. Something. Yeah. Mechanical issues or something like that. So Earth Angels, I don't know. Somebody wanted you to pick them up. Or somebody was waiting for your lover or something to pick them up. And something might not happen the way this person wanted it to. Yeah, Earth Angels, for some of y'all, be careful. Because this person could be married or somebody trying to give you karma. And they saying one thing. It's like this person be like, oh, I love you. But it's like this person go behind your back and be talking. To, oh, man, this person. Or um, Earth Angels, this person don't view you as family. This could be your spouse, but this is your karmic spouse. It's like they don't view you as family or something. Or Earth Angels, you're not of this person's culture or something. So it's like this person don't see no reason why not to offend you. You're not of their culture or something like that. I also see Earth Angel, somebody is going to offend you one too many times between the past and this week. And Earth Angel, you're going to tell this person, we're not friends. We're not friends. So Earth Angel, somebody could be um, taking shots at your culture, your accent. Um, somebody being funny and they're going to regret it. Some of y'all, this could have been y'all lover. Yeah. They was telling you like they love you, but it's like they was making fun of your... Somebody can have a lisp or something. And Earth Angels, you like, nah, you straight. I'm going home. I'm going with my family and my friends where we all speak the same language or something. So Earth Angels, for some of y'all, this was like a, a potential lover that was um, making fun of your culture or something like that. And you done this week. You're done, yeah. Yeah, Earth Angel, somebody really don't like you that like that or something. But this person was being fake though. Yeah. Earth Angels, for some of y'all, this person mad at you because you don't trust them. <laughs> but you're not supposed to. <laughs> Or something. This person wants something from you that's like, no, or something. Yeah, you're never available. Yeah. So, our thing is, you could be a man. And it's a woman. Um, You were supposed to, like, pay for play with her. So, our thing is, for some of y'all, I heard an Uber. Our thing is, for some of y'all, it's a female that made you an offer in the past or this week. And she wanted you to pay for play, but you're never available. For some of y'all, this is an undercover cop. And for other you guys, it's not. Or something. Yeah, Earth Angel, somebody was trying to set you up or something. But you're never available or you're not going to be able to answer your phone. Or your phone could have died or something like that. Something happened. Somebody... You're never av available to pay for play. Yeah. So somebody need to stay away from prostitutes, prostitution. Because um, somebody been being watched since Christmas. So whatever this is, it's kind of big. For It's like the authorities been watching you for a year. <laughs> That's a long time. Somebody in trouble. <laughs> yeah. So. So, Earth Angels, you might emotionally walk away. You might walk away. And somebody else, or these people gonna get caught in the act. They gonna have legal issues. Bad contracts. So, Earth Angels, don't get caught in the mix. You're a very you're a high vibrational person, but don't get caught in a mix. Don't get caught with this person or at this place or something. Yeah, something like that. 
Aren't they just for some of y'all? You had nothing to do with this. You don't go to this place. But this person be at this place or involved in this and they be saying your name. So, Earth Angels, for some of y'all, Spirit is telling you to let go of somebody. It could be an air sign. It could be a Libra. It could be a water sign. It could be a Virgo. It's like Earth signs. How are you never at this location? You're not associated with these people. But you being high vibrational, you're attached to, like, a bad contract. Or somebody signed y'all name to something. Or something. And spirit telling you to stay away from this person or something. Because they doing something behind your back. Yeah, something. Yep. Or well, it's like earth angels. Spirit don't want you with this person when this person get caught. <laughs> he do not. <clears throat> so earth angels, this is like somebody using your identity and you didn't know. And both of y'all supposed to go on the airplane or something. Yeah. It's like this person was using your ID. It's like and you didn't even know it or something. Something? I heard Earth Angels, you not being there when this person get caught is better like that. Because it'll make it easier for them to prove your innocence. And you are innocent, Earth Angels. Yeah. So, Earth Angels, somebody could have signed your name to a bad contract. They signed your name. Or something. Yep. Somebody going to get caught in the act signing somebody's signature to something. Mm-hmm. And this could be, I just saw, this could be a photo ID. So, I don't know, this could be a passport or something. Or Earth Angels, somebody had your picture on their passport or something. So, Earth Angels, I don't know if you look like somebody or something. But it's like your picture or something. And this is like a false passport or somebody got your picture on their passport or something. But because you, if your, your picture is there, it makes the passport false. Because it's not your passport. They just using your picture or something. So the passport is like a bad contract or something like that. Something somebody doing? Yeah. Yeah. So Earth Angels, for some of y'all, you might hold back from this person. Earth Angels, you could be the four of pentacles and you holding back from this person. And it could be because you're with family or friends or something. You want to act through the energy. So you hold it back from this person. And I think that's spirit led. Because the will of fortune. What's this? The world? Yeah, the world. That's a major arcana. Then we got justice. Yeah. And then the hermit. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Just for some of y'all, I had I heard don't do no favors for your lovers. Especially if this person rubbed you the wrong way this week or in the or in the past, don't do no favors for this lover this week or something. This person got a sharp tongue. It's like this person disrespects you. They have they don't have respect for you. So this is definitely the type of energy that are like forge your name, no respect, um, things like that. Yeah. Yeah, something. Yeah, it's like this person think you a fool. They think you an idiot. For some of y'all, you're you're married to this person and they disrespect you. And they say, "Oh, it's meant to be. I like you. I love you. You my one and only." Then it's like this person go off and be talking junk about you or something, or forging your name or something like that. So, I'm going to end it. So, yeah. So, this is Black Queen Tarot. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and or share. And Earth Angels, enjoy the weekend. Thanks.